All right, guys, this is David Dodge. Thanks for watching. This video is going to be on real estate investing tips for beginners. Now, before we get started, guys, make sure you subscribe to this video and comment down below that you subscribed. At the end of every month, we do a shout out to one lucky person who has subscribed and also commented that they subscribed. Real estate investing tips for beginners. Where do you start if you are a beginner and you want to become a real estate investor? The simple answer to that is you should go to your local real estate investment club. Go on meetup.com and figure out where all the other real estate investors are meeting either weekly or monthly, okay? Unless you live in the most country town there is, I can almost ensure you that there will be at least one real estate investing club in your local area. Where I'm from, St. Louis, Missouri, right here in the Midwest, there is almost a meetup or a real estate club almost every day of the week. I would say at least three, if not four days of every single week. There are people in my market that get together and they share ideas and pass deals and partner with each other, lend each other money, so on and so forth. You want to start there. You want to get yourself in front of the people that are doing it and doing it already. The reason is, is you can learn a tremendous amount from these people. When I first started, I went to real estate clubs. I found a guy that had a deal. I had some money. We partnered up. That was my very first fix and flip. He also taught me a little bit about marketing. From there, I dove into wholesaling. And guess where I sell most of my wholesale deals? I go to real estate clubs. I meet cash buyers that are looking for their next rental property, their next fix and flip opportunity, and I sell these guys my deals. Where do you think I found all of the private and hard money lenders that lend me money to buy and fix houses? Real estate clubs. I can't emphasize this enough. If you are new to real estate investing and you wanna learn a strategy, and it doesn't really matter if that strategy is to wholesale or to fix and flip or to buy rentals and be a landlord, it doesn't matter. You wanna go find the people that are already doing that. Those are the people that you can have mentor you, you can pay them for coaching, you can partner with them, you can sell them deals, they can sell you deals. That's where the magic happens. Now, people tell me this all the time, Dave, I'm having trouble finding a hard money lender. And my question to them is, how many real estate clubs have you been to this week or even this month? And nine times out of 10, the answer is zero. These lenders want to be found, guys. They make money when they give you a loan and you pay them back with interest. That's how they make a living. That's how they make their money. So they want to be found. So I can ensure you, if you go find your local real estate club or clubs and you start attending these meetings, you will meet these people and they are going to be eager and happy to lend you money so you can go buy yourself a fix and flip or a rental or even help fund marketing. I have some of my strategic partners right now that actually pay me money every month to help my marketing. And that marketing consists of yellow letters, postcards, skip tracing, cold calling, cold texting, AdWords, pay-per-click, Facebook, ringless voicemails, radio advertisements, advertisements in the paper, you name it. We do a ton of things to locate motivated sellers. But in some scenarios, people will want those deals so bad that they will partner with you and or prepay you for those deals by helping fund marketing. So if you are new to real estate investing, my number one tip would be to go to these local real estate clubs Meet the people that are doing what you want to do. Make friends with them, partner with them. Ask them how you can help them. If you don't have any money or anything to bring to the table, then ask them what you can do to make their life easier. And that may be running errands on a Saturday or a Sunday. That may be going to Lowe's or Home Depot twice a week and picking up materials and delivering it to their job site for free. You are going to trade some of your time to be around these people, to listen to these conversations they're having. And then hopefully they will help you analyze deals. They'll show you under the covers or under the hood of their business 
and how they are making money. That is the easiest and the first thing you should do. Find your local real estate club, go meet the movers and shakers and go start working with them or volunteering to help them. Or maybe you already have capital. You can find your deals there. If you're a wholesaler and you already have deals coming in, take your deals there. Those people want to find their next deal. So again, I cannot emphasize it enough. Local real estate clubs are the absolute best place to start. Now, if you want to learn how to wholesale, I have a special treat for you guys. I actually created a course called Free Wholesale Course, and you can find it at freewholesalecourse.com or down below in the comments area, we'll link to it. And it is a course that my partner Mike and I built out to help you understand what wholesaling is, how it works, and how you can start marketing either with a time budget or a capital budget to find these motivated sellers. So you can start doing deals or you can start wholesaling, so on and so forth. But the number one thing you need to do if you are new to real estate investing is you got to get off your rear end and you gotta go to these real estate clubs. I've been investing in real estate for over 15 years. I've been doing it full time for over five and I still love going to these clubs. Now I'm speaking at a lot of these clubs, but I still love going because I usually will learn something even after 15 years. But more importantly with that, I love leaving with a stack of business cards that I've gotten from everybody in the room that I was able to network with because I can acquire more lenders, I can acquire more buyers, and I can find other wholesalers who may have a deal for me. Just because I'm wholesaling property doesn't mean that I won't buy property from another wholesaler. We do it all the time. Time. So guys, get off your butt, go find a real estate club. The easiest way to do that is to go to meetup.com. Another way to do it is to go on Facebook, go to your local groups, type in your city, Cincinnati, Tampa, Denver, real estate, and you'll find these different groups and people will be promoting their club within these groups. So go do that, meet these people. If you're interested in wholesaling, check out freewholesalecourse.com and that's it. That's all you need to do to get the ball rolling. Go find the guy that's doing it and have him become your mentor, shadow him, network with him. Even if he's too busy and he can only meet you for coffee once a month, take him up on it and buy the coffee. Okay, that is the first thing you need to do in order to wholesale real estate and or to get involved in real estate investing. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Also comment below that you subscribed and hopefully you win the shout out of the month. But guys, I'm David Dodge signing off and that's all you gotta do in order to get started investing in real estate. Find the clubs, find the people at the clubs, make friends and boom, you now have partners, you now have people that will buy deals from you, and you also have people that will want to sell you deals. What more could you ask for if you are wanting to become a real estate investor? All right, guys, signing off.